Okay guys, so before this video kind of gets fully started, I just want to go ahead and put a disclaimer out here. Man, this is a wild episode. There was no really cursing or anything. Just to do a summary of kind of what happened throughout that night, uh, let's just say my lighter ended up not working. I ended up having to wait like 15, 20 minutes just to get the cigar relit. On top of that, then I had the kids in the background. You couldn't ask for anything pretty much worse, but it did end up being a really good night. Uh, I ended up finding someone who did have a lighter. Uh, I met some new people but i just want to bring a little disclaimer out there the next video that you're going to see in the cigar series though is going to be awesome uh this one though was i had to cut this one kind of short just because it was later at night i was really tired already from earlier that day i was filming all that day and i would just want to relax and now i know though make sure to bring an extra cigar lighter on top of that make sure you bring extra butane just in case those type of things happen uh now i know make sure you always bring extra stuff with you and i usually do but for some reason i just thought oh no it's gonna be warm outside you should be good and i was wrong that's all i wanted to say hope you all enjoy the video give it a thumbs up subscribe now let's go ahead and run that intro <laughs> to my cigar lounge today i'm actually in north carolina actually i'm in south carolina right now uh, i'm actually doing a little trip for an amusement park and uh just a little special occasion so i'm back out here and uh i'm gonna be checking out an actual cuban cigar this time i have it in uh, my boba pack i brought this with me uh, it's right here it's at 68 percent. it was just at 70 percent. i just opened it up and uh, i had this one with me for a minute but this is actually sent to me by a guy named Ian. He was the first person to actually send me a cigar. Uh, this is an official Cuban cigar. Like, this is no joke. Uh, I've always wanted to smoke a Cuban, and I'm excited to check this one out. Uh, it feels amazing. It looks awesome. Check out that sticker. It smells very like cocoa. Cocoa vibes. That's what I get. But the wrapper on it feels awesome. Uh, overall, it's pretty veiny too. You can tell like they wrap this on tight. So yeah. But uh, I got my cigar cutter right here. Don't mind the background noise. Uh, I'm just outside of the hotel right now. The notes on this, actually the price for this one is going to be, I think about $14, $15 a stick. Today is May 15th by the way and it is 68 degrees. It's 822 right now, but the sun has been setting later and later. So I'm really excited to check this one out. I think this is going to last about at least an hour or so. But this is Partagas Series D number four. I'm going to go ahead and cut it and uh, we're going to go ahead and lead it lit. Got my Calibri cutter right here. I'll definitely try to get a V cutter or a punch hole cutter too soon. But uh, let's get this cut going. Come on. It looks pretty good to me. Looks pretty good. I didn't take much off. Yeah, let's go ahead and get it lit though. We'll just, uh, for the most part, we'll just toast it first and then we'll light it up. Oh, no. Alright, so right at light up. My lighter was acting really funny. I was like, oh man, I, I, was, I didn't even bring my second one thinking like, oh no, I'm not going to need it because it's going to be warm. And uh, I definitely needed the second one, but it's all good. I was able to get it lit. First one light up though. It's very smooth. Like I don't get any full body yet, but it's just really smooth. So I'll talk to y'all in like the first third in like a couple minutes. I just lit it, which was at 829. Well, let's just say 828 because that's probably when I actually lit this, and uh, I'll talk to y'all soon. Yeah, the burn is my fault because the lighter, I need another lighter, <laughs> and I really wish I had got a better lighter, but check out the band on it. Overall, though, it's still burning pretty well, but I definitely know I have to get a better uh, lighter. I want to do it one more time. It's so fun because all you got to do is have fun with it. Okay guys, so I'm in a little bit of a predicament. I don't have it. I didn't bring any extra lighter juice because I'm sitting here thinking, oh yeah, it's full. And now I'm out of my lighter thing. So I don't know, are you able to save a cigar? I don't think that's possible. 
what I'm gonna try to do is basically get a lighter uh, from somebody so I can light this thing and we're gonna see what happens so if I can the video will keep going if I can't well then I'm screwed but uh, if that's the case then this video might not happen I might just have to redo this entire video in the future or something. So we'll see. Okay, so I just met these guys. What's your name? I don't know what they're saying. They're saying they're saying no, no, Sakuri Montes do Mamore, Sakuri Montes do Macachi, Sakuri Montes do Macachi, Sakuri Montes do Macachi, Sakuri Montes do so they're Brazilian. Uh, they were able to get me a lighter. So I got to relate. Um, they're really cool guys. Uh, I'm at the hotel right now, but big shout out to them. Uh, John John and all of them. Y'all could check Wearing out. million dollar watches right here. Yeah, at the airport. Rolex, Rolex. Here's a roadie, roadie, roadie. This is a Richard Mills. 1.2 million dollar watch. Y'all see oh, that? Valenciaga. <laughs> Valenciaga's Gucci's. They're out here in uh, South Carolina. Let me stunting on people. <laughs> but they have an awesome looking Beamer. Check this thing out. Uh, thing is amazing. They're staying the night here too. I literally just met them for the first time. But that's what happens when um, you're just out here filming. People just come along. Really cool people, though. This cigar is really creamy. Um, it's very just smooth. It's really smooth cigar. Um, I'm probably going to conclude the video there. Thank you all for watching. Really appreciate it. I'm glad that I was able to get it relit. But uh, I'll talk to you all in the next one. Thank you all for watching. Until next time, remember to give this video a thumbs up. Subscribe if you want to see more content like this. And until next time, peace out.